How to achieve your personal development goals. Personal development is a catchphrase often used by scholars, mentors, colleagues, or even family members. But what exactly does it mean in a daily setting? Personal development is a phrase that refers to activities designed to improve talents, potential, employability, and even wealth. Any time you are consciously making an effort to improve yourself, you are participating in personal development. The importance of personal growth cannot be understated, as it allows individuals to become the best versions of themselves. Giving them the skills and confidence necessary to navigate any situation. How adults experience life is majorly dependent on factors such as employment, real life experiences and interactions, neighborhoods, and many more factors. Personal development doesn't refer to a specific timeline of adulthood. Instead, it requires a lifetime of dedication and awareness to keep up with the natural ebbs and flows that life has to offer. Personal development doesn't only refer to improving the personal aspects of our lives, however. It also applies to professional development and the steps you can take to further your career and your knowledge to become a more well rounded, productive employee. This could mean hitting a huge business milestone, getting the promotion you've worked for day in and day out, or taking steps to sharpen your skill set. What is personal development? As discussed above, personal development can help you embrace your full potential and improve your quality of life. As a result of personal development, your life's biggest dreams and aspirations can come true. And you'll have the skills to thrive in any scenario. Motivating yourself to be the best version that you can be is easier said than done. However, personal development can provide a clear path to a happier and more fulfilled life. To start your path toward personal development, consider the following approach. You'll want to start by creating a personal vision. Even if this step is completed for fun, It can help you envision where you want to be both personally and professionally in one month, six months, one year, etc. Setting targets for yourself can keep you motivated and on track. Refer to these goals often to ensure you are taking the necessary steps toward success. The next step of personal development is the planning stage. Now that you have a clear understanding of your ideal life in the future, It's time to start planning how you can get there. Consider conducting a personal SWOT analysis in which you outline your biggest strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. Self reflection is a huge part of personal development, so creating a SWOT analysis is a great way to start thinking in this mindset. You can create separate personal development goals for your professional career and your personal life. Although there may be some overlapping between the two areas, some skills that can facilitate personal growth include communication, work ethic, leadership, organization, problem solving, confidence, and integrity, just to name a few. Once you have started the improvement process, make sure to keep track of how your progress is going. Keeping some sort of written record of your goals. The steps you are taking to get there, and any roadblocks can help further motivate you to become better. After a few weeks have passed, don't be afraid to re evaluate and readjust your goals to better align with your strides in development. Life is full of unexpected circumstances and surprises that may have an impact on your goals or your pacing. Learn to embrace these changes and go with the flow instead of becoming frustrated when a situation doesn't play out how you expected. Why is personal development important? Why do we need personal development? Allegro Media Design Sure Personal Development allows you to understand who you are at your core and what goals you are setting out to accomplish. This is one of the simplest keys to a lifetime of fulfillment and happiness. 
It's easy to miss life's subliminal messages and guidance if you are only going through the motions. This is where personal development comes into play. It is a shift in your mindset that allows you to embark on a meaningful journey of growth and self-reflection. When you start incorporating personal development into your life, you'll likely find yourself asking questions such as, in my ideal world, what would I be doing with my time and energy? If I'm unhappy at my current job, what other career path would I want? If I had unlimited resources to make changes in my life, what would these changes look like? What are simple changes I can make to my routine to deepen my happiness? If you're looking for reasons as to why personal development is important, there are endless reasons to incorporate this tactic into your life. Here are only some of the benefits of personal development. 1. It keeps you motivated. Staying motivated both personally and professionally doesn't come naturally for everyone. Even those who are particularly skilled at finding motivation often may need to refer to their personal development goals to stay on track. A quick review of your personal development goals can reignite your fire and motivate you to be better. In terms of professional development, Having clear personal development plans can also help keep employees loyal to their organization. Many factors contribute to overall job joy in today's world, with money only being one of them. Employees also want to be pushed, learn new skills, take advantage of training courses, and feel as though they are contributing to a company that values them. 2. It allows you to reflect on your talents. Another benefit of personal development is that it allows you to reflect on your strengths, oftentimes highlighting and unearthing some skills you didn't realize you have. If you're unsure what is considered to be a talent, know that it is something that you can complete with relative ease. Feel comfortable doing. Don't require supervision while doing it. As you reflect on your development learning process, reflect on the current talents you possess in addition to the talents you wish you had. This can act as a roadmap if you need to focus on developing certain skills in the future. 3. It refine your existing skills. Stepping back and evaluating your current skills can give you the push you need to further lean into them and refine them. It's only natural if one of your reasons for personal development is to improve upon your current skills and talents, even if it means failing along the way. Are you particularly skilled at communicating? Are you a natural leader and you don't even realize it? Personal development allows you to pinpoint where you excel and can make you even better at your existing skills. Embrace scenarios where your current skills let you down and know that failing is expected on this journey. In fact, failing is one of the hallmarks of personal development, and it will only propel you further into success in the future. Take failing as an opportunity to further improve your skills and improve upon them. 4. It increases employee confidence. Focusing your energy on personal development can ultimately increase your daily confidence in your career. While you may not associate being confident at work with producing higher quality work, these two things go hand in hand. This is especially the case for employees who often interact directly with clients to sell a product or service. For example, if you feel confident in your ability to speak with clients articulately and you are well versed in your company's offerings, the client will be able to pick up on this and they will have a better experience with you. This positive energy will shine through each of your conversations with clients and can also help improve your relationships with your boss and coworkers. 5. It reduces staff turnover. From a business perspective, 
Personal development is important because it keeps employees happy and more loyal to the company. Your staff will be more committed to a job if they know that their boss is equally committed to personal development. This employees come first mindset can go a long way in keeping your valued employees at your company for as long as possible. The longer employees stick around, the more value they bring to your company, as they have fostered meaningful relationships with clients and other employees. 6. It supports a healthy work culture. The culture at your work will undoubtedly have a significant impact on your overall job happiness. While this is an intangible aspect of any company, employees know a healthy work culture when they experience it. If your company leans into personal development and encourages employees to ask questions, take risks, and make valuable connections, chances are high that employees will feel valued and will produce high-quality work. 7. It improves self-awareness. Another reason self-development is important is that it helps individuals reflect on who they are at the core. It's easy to get caught up in your daily schedule and routine without carving out the time to reflect. It forces individuals to find happiness in their own lives while encouraging self-awareness and reflection. At the end of the day, you are the only person responsible for your happiness, and reflecting on your core values and beliefs can help you achieve a deeper and more meaningful level of happiness. 8. It provides a sense of direction. Understanding your purpose in life and mapping out the steps you need to get there can be an overwhelming and daunting task. Should you stay at your current job or look for a new position? Is it best to stay in the city you're used to or push yourself and move elsewhere? These are only a couple of major life decisions that many people grapple with daily. However, if you are taking the necessary steps to reflect on your life and practice self-reflection, you'll find it significantly easier to make decisions that will deepen your happiness. Decisions that once used to take hours, months, or even years will come naturally. You'll be able to focus your energy on positive changes instead of stressing about the direction your life is heading. 9. It increases creativity. Another reason why we need personal development is it helps promote creativity both at work and beyond. Your change in mindset will allow you to embrace creativity in all aspects of your life and lean into innovation. An open mind can go a long way in taking the pressure off of yourself. There's no need to be perfect at everything you do. Once you let your guard down and embrace everything life has to offer, your creativity will shine through in all that you do. 10. It increases resilience. Life can throw curveballs your way. In fact, you should expect them. If you approach difficult situations with the mindset that they will only make you stronger and more well-rounded in the end, you'll be able to navigate any situation with grace. While you can't avoid bad things from happening, personal development will teach you the skills that you need to get through hard times, and this will also directly impact your confidence for the better. Areas of self-improvement. Ready to create self-improvement goals, but not sure where to begin? Start assessing these areas of your life. 1. Career Whether you want to open a business or earn a promotion at your current company, there is always room for improvement in the workplace. Learn a new skill, attend an immersive business event or connect with a mentor who can help you identify your strengths. If you want to improve your career, you must work for it. 2. Relationships Relationships are the bedrock of your life. Quality relationships lead to a more fulfilled and happy life. Whether it's your relationship with family, friends, co-workers or your romantic partner, 
they are all critical for happiness. Take a look to see how your relationships can benefit from strong self-improvement goals. Can you deepen some of these bonds? How can you be more present for your loved ones? Whatever you can do to strengthen these relationships is going to benefit you in the long run. 3. Finance. Financial health is an important segment to consider on your personal improvement journey. There is nothing stopping you from learning how to manage your money better. Learning how to attain financial freedom is a fine place to start in your self-improvement journey. A lot of stress can stem from financial worries. Eliminate those worries by learning how to best manage your money. 4. Health. Your body will function far better with more energy. The better your body functions, the more you're able to achieve in your life. You can strengthen and build up emotional, physical and mental health. Fuel your body and mind with healthy food, extensive knowledge and positive thoughts. How to set and achieve self-improvement goals. Setting self-improvement goals is about raising your standards and getting to work. You can do that by getting total clarity on your vision for your life, then relating your goals back to this purpose. Here's how to achieve your self-improvement goals. 1. Identify your objectives. If you don't have specific goals in mind yet, think about what you ultimately want to accomplish. Picture yourself one year, two years or five years from now. What are you doing? Where are you? Who are you with? How are you relating to others? Hone in on where you are and where you want to be. What do you want and why? Where focus goes, energy flows. When you have absolute clarity on what it is you want, you'll stop at nothing to achieve your self-improvement goal. 2. Establish your purpose. It's easy to say, I want to move up at my job and make more money, but why? To create lasting change, you must connect your self-improvement goals with what will ultimately bring you the most fulfillment. Do you want to excel professionally so you can provide for your family or is a higher earning job a way to pursue your other passions? Is being a wonderful parent important to you because you had a rocky childhood? When you have your ultimate purpose in mind, you won't be deterred when problems or plateaus arise, and you'll find you have the strength to work through them. 3. Break down your limiting beliefs. Limiting beliefs are one of the biggest obstacles to self-improvement. If you spend a lot of time questioning yourself or even putting yourself down, you're getting in the way of meeting your goals and improving your life. Pay attention to your self-talk and change negative words to empowering statements. Thinking about yourself in a more positive way sets the stage for you to improve the way you treat yourself and others. 4. 4. Set smart goals. Once you identify your end goal, you can work backward to generate the landmarks you'll need to hit to attain it. Make sure you're following the SMART goal setting process. Specific, measurable, achievable, realistic and within a time frame. If moving up at your job is your self-improvement goal, then your immediate tasks could include taking classes or gaining certifications that are helpful in your field. If you ultimately want to become a better parent, then learning how to better communicate with your child is something to work toward in the short term. 5. Track and celebrate your progress. Setting metrics that allow you to measure your success is essential to creating and achieving SMART goals. To give yourself the best chance at self-improvement, give yourself clear objectives to hit, like taking a certain number of professional courses in a set period of time. This will help you can track your self-improvement. When you reach your goals, celebrate your wins. Go as big as a spa day or as small as a champagne toast with your partner. 
Taking the time to recognize how far you've come will fuel you to go even farther. 6. Get inspired. Surround yourself with people who are also driven to be the best. Find out their self-improvement strategies and emulate them. You can also work with a business coach or results coach, depending on your goals. Surrounding yourself with positive people feeds your drive, but don't forget to feed your mind by taking in new information. Read a self-help book. Take educational courses on interesting subjects. Make the time to bring new and stimulating ideas into your life. 7. Master a new skill. Still stuck on personal improvement ideas? You could be in a cycle of certainty, and it's time to get out of your comfort zone. Expanding your skill set with something entirely new, like learning a new language or how to play a music instrument, pushes your brain to make fresh neural connections. When you master something new, you discover that you can master even more. You'll develop a growth mindset that will make you truly unstoppable. 8. Use the right tools. We often let self-improvement fall by the wayside because we don't have the time. But the number of hours in the day isn't the problem. Work on your personal improvement in a smart way. Use strategies like chunking and Tony's rapid planning method to help you get more done. Writing down your goals and dreams can also make them more real to you. Cement your drive and help you cultivate a sense of mindfulness so that you'll continue working toward your goals even when you face challenges. The benefits of journaling for self-improvement are endless. One of the best things you can do for yourself is to focus on personal development. No one has your best interest at heart more than you do for yourself. So committing to change your life for the better will be the best thing you can do. The results from focusing on yourself are amazing. You'll have not only a better relationship with yourself but with those around you. If you like this podcast, please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe.